the magical feeling of match day and the desire to lose yourself in the moment. That's what today is all about. A meeting of two talented sides ready to go at it in front of a capacity crowd, not to mention the eyes of the wider football world. Stay tuned, we're live next on EA TV. Hello and welcome to the south coast of England. We're here at the Amex Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, and ready with his tactics board alongside me is Stuart Robson, my commentary partner. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Brighton up against Manchester United. Real chance. Oh, did so well to deny him. See a short one. Rashford! Rashford! A terrific piece of anticipation! And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Well, in this shape, their two holding midfield players will be key today. If they can get on the ball and dictate the play, protect the two centre-backs, it will then allow the attacking players to show their creative quality. There's the lineup for the visitors today. Well, we believe they're going to play for the same system here. It's all about the midfield battle. Whoever wins that should control the tactics. Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. Well, that reaction says it all. That's such an important goal in this game. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Joel Feldman. Moda. Might be able to set up the chance. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Diogo Dallo. Bruno Fernandes has it. Not really be able to trouble them here. Can he find the angle? And a goal here for Manchester United. They are the big favourites now. Well, here's the replay. He's got such quick feet, hasn't he? Just look how he goes past his marker to get his shot away. That's a really good goal. Well, he looks really pleased, doesn't he? His side have been really good today. So, 2-0 now. Take it away. He won the ball. That's a good-looking ball. Well, now in a dangerous position. A superb chance. But he's failed the test. Well, you can see what he was trying to do, but he's missed the target. He should score there. Possession one. And teammates to play it to.
Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. So on with the game again. United in charge. The scoreline threatening to get ugly. the half-time whistle the first half action is over here on the south coast well there's a sound reason why we're focusing on him he's making his presence felt in attack Stuart well you won't see too many better performances than this he's been an absolute menace to these defenders today and of course he's taken his goals really well Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us.
Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. that they didn't score. Well, had he scored, that would have been a great goal. The speed in which they changed from defence to attack was brilliant.
going for the short one. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time. Great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Well, that's just what he wanted. He has to be happy with this performance. They've been good today. And there it is, the full-time whistle. A victory for Manchester United. Well, Derek, they were the better team all over the pitch. We saw good individual performances. We saw an attack which was always threatening, and they played really well. What a performance that was today.